Hello, it's been a while since I posted on YouTube, but besides that fact, we're going to be reviewing The Marvel Legends Fang from Hasbro. Hope you enjoy this video. So basically, the first thing you notice on this figure, as soon as you open it out of the package, you can notice that this orange is miscolored right here. It should have just stayed the normal orange. And the pens are like a pinkish color. I don't know why. Let's take a look at what I'm talking about. Down here, it's like pinkish. I don't know why. It's really weird, and you can't really see it. It's on this, so it's not noticeable, but it's just a thing I'm pointing out. Let me, put, let me get the head back on real quick. <clears throat> Alright, there we go. So looking at this guy off the bat, he's a pretty dope figure, and I like him. So starting off down here, um, there is a few paint chips on mine. Uh, there's a scratch down here, I don't know why. But besides that, it's all good. This is supposed to be all roughed up, so I'm fine with it, with like the rocks and stuff like that. It's just the orange right here they put on here. That I do not like. But besides that, this is a good figure, honestly. So, that was enough for the paint that I do not like. The rest of it's pretty solid. So, now we're going to be looking at accessories. Alright, this guy has um, six individual accessories that you can use. Um, got this um, teeth right here. Like he's showing off his teeth. And then this head. Kinda looks like he's shocked. He's got this open hand. Same one for this, the open hand. And then these two fists. One for the right and one for the left. But um yeah. These are pretty good accessories. Um I don't see no complaints. They're all good. Except for this one. It looks like a little derby to be honest. I don't know why, it just looks a little derby. But besides that, it's all good. I've already shown like half the articulation in this video, but we're going to be going over it in just one little subject of the time lapse, so let's do it. Hopefully you guys seen that in the actual time lapse. It wasn't the best time lapse in the world, but so we're going to go over it in like an actual video. So this goes up and down. This is, there is not a joint here, by the way. And then this twist, it's got like that female body mold that I don't really like, but on this figure, it makes sense. But it's got that, it goes up and down. Then here, it has an average hand. And then a joint in there, of course, it spins around. An ab crunch, ain't the best ab crunch. And then they got a 360 swivel on the hand. I mean, not the hand, the uh, head. And then a of course, the up and down uh, neck peg. It's not the newer one they've been doing lately. Let's get Deadpool, for example. Like the new head joint they've been doing, like this. The ball peg, I like that one kind of more. I don't really like how they did the Deadpool one, though. But um, it's got joints down here, a twist right here, then a knee joint, a double knee right there. And then. Of course, the average foot, it moves the same but normal Marvel Legend as it would. And, yeah, it's got the same articulation, just a bigger figure. It's still good, though. So, um, yeah. So, I'm going to put my final thoughts on this in a couple seconds. Alright, so now it's time for my final opinions. I rate the articulation... A 8 out of 10. Could have been a little bit better on the ab crunch. Paint abs, I give it a 5. And the overall would probably be a 9 out of 10. It's really good. And I like it. The accessories are decent. Could have done a better job on the face sculpt right here. But overall, it's a 9 out of 10. It's really good. And I recommend y'all should get this. If you're getting it for retail price, do not go for like a scalper price. Because retail price in this bad boy is godly. I'm just going to say that. This would be like a $30 figure right now. If. 
they like uh didn't release it in like every single store but the thing is so good it's better than the older one they made in my opinion don't get mad in the comments but that's my opinion and uh what else I want to point out that in the future I might make a video black washing this guy so he looks a little bit more accurate and I might change out the paint on the uh down here and all that stuff and it's even on the feet too so I'm gonna get all that changed out so it actually looks decent like the actual thing on the image of the box so yeah I'll see y'all later and peace out